Last though, we got a nice inclusion. This is the library ghost. Awesome. So you guys see, she got this nice purple plastic. See for plastic? Pretty cool. Here's her front of her. Sides. Oh, she's actually a pretty cool character, though. She's a, she's wow. Okay, look at those teeth. She's like, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Got gray hair. So yeah, this is a pretty cool inclusion. So we're done with all the minifigures. We're gonna start off with the side of the firehouse. Here we starting off with a door. It's not open. It's just a sticker. That's okay. Got this nice floor. It ends right here. Some bricks. Windows. More windows. You guys see all the way at the back is a Legos Age of Ultron set to put the Hulk. But yeah, here's windows. Red bricks now. Yeah, so that's the side. Now here's the front. We start off with the bottom. We got what are these called again? Oh my gosh. Can't think of the word right now. And here are the yellow stripes. These are stickers, by the way. We got the red door. And that does open. It's cool. The garage door. Going to the top. Do got the nice iconic sign with the Ghostbuster symbol here. There's the other side. And what I like, if you have the Ecto-1 set, you can open the door and store the Ecto-1 in there. Oh. So yeah, it does fit in there. Then we close the door. There. First of all, I just wanted to get this out of the way that, uh... Um, it does come with uh, four of these slime pieces that you can just stick wherever you want. Just wanted to show you guys. So now I have 12 slime pieces. Moving that away, let's start off with the first floor. First up, we got the containment union room. Union room. Oh my gosh. That's a hard word to say. So we got Ray here. Um, he's reading some sort of news. Newspaper. Let's take this out. Show you guys. So here's the front. So it's just Playmobile mobile today. Ghostbusters. So we got the um, Egon and Ray and Peter Bankman on the front of the newspaper. We got Jenny on the side. Here's the other side of the front. So we got Lady Liberty. Lady Liberty, a map, a Ghostbuster symbol, the firehouse. Play mobile there. That's the front. Okay, here's the now inside. It has the Ecto One. This is Ecto One there. Slimer, proton pack, picture proton pack, trap. So this is pretty cool. And we do got the clips for them to hold it in their hands. Getting real deep in, we do got this a uh, nice containment union. Un oh my gosh, here we go again. But um. Here we, it says danger on the front. That This is a sticker with all the buttons and everything. So here's what you put all your traps in when there's ghosts inside there. So you wanna do is move this lever down. Push it down. Get your trap. Get up for a second. Get your trap. Plug it right in. Close it. Hold this down. Now the ghosts are safe inside there. Safe and sound. Not gonna bother anyone. So that's pretty cool how they had this. I think that's a cool feature. Over here we got a danger sticker, some lights, and pipes. That rhymes. Lights and pipes. So we're done. Other than that, they're just windows. And it's just a empty room for you to put your Ecto-1. If you guys wondering what I'm using as a light, it's uh, my Minecraft torch. 
So here's my, probably my favorite room of the house, the experiment room. So right now we got a nice icon iconic scene right here that you can replay where Egon is doing a test on Lewis to see what's wrong with him. And he is a, the key master, which he got possessed by one of the terror dogs. So yeah, Egon's doing his test. There's Egon, he has his PKE meter, reading all that. We got this nice camera to put on Lewis. There, and you could move these to adjust it. Put it there. And what the camera is actually doing, just pick up oh, all that just, just, just fell. But you got this nice screen with a sticker of a terror dog. So that's what's inside Lewis. We do got these nice drawers that you could open. You can put stuff inside there, close it, and we got this nice machine that I'm pretty sure it's doing some readings on Lewis. So he has a, these are all stickers, it says Ghostbuster, there, it has buttons, that's cool, it has wheels, so then you can roll it around, place. and if you're wondering what Lewis is sitting on, on Egon as well. He's sitting on this stool. There are some windows there in the back, but I wanted to show you this shelf. So here's the shelf. It got, it has a potion. Green potion. In there. And it has some more potions to do some experiments on. Two empty ones and one green one. And you got this book inside there. Check it out. It does not open, but yeah. So it does not open, but it. Okay, so it says um, to Tobin's Spirit Guide has the Ghostbuster logo. Here's the back. On top of the shelf, you get these two pans. One big one, one small one. Oh, and there was some stuff on here that you might have saw in the start of when I was showing the room. We got pizza. Start off with pizza. So here's the pizza box. It has a sticker of a pizza. It says pizza on there. Nothing on the back, but you can open it and it has a pizza on the top of the stickers. Just one whole big sticker. And it looks like you got some pepperoni, ham, some normal stuff on there pizza. It looks like a pretty good pizza. And it also comes with this weird thing. I have no idea what this is. It's probably one of their gadgets. G gadgets. So, yeah. And it comes with another chair. There. Blue and gray. And it comes with a lamp. And it, this other cart that has w nice wheels. But it has Two red potions. Yeah, some science things. Pretty cool. So Egon has a lo uh, lots of stuff to do some experiments on Lewis. So done with the experiment room. Let's go on the last floor, third floor. So here's Janie's office, the third floor. You can see Janie's on her computer, but uh oh, the library ghost is about to scare her. So that's cool. You got this uh, pan or bowl, whatever you want to call it. And you can put your PKE meter that comes inside. It only comes with one. Put in there. And let's just take out Janie. I'll show you the chair. Here's the chair. And let's show you the computer. Here's the computer. That is a print on there. It's pretty cool as a map. And it has the Ghostbusters logo. So they're trying to track, track some ghosts. So that's awesome. We got the keys. And we got another shelf over there. Oh, something just fell. So here's this dresser. You could open the doors of it. 
there, like so. There's a phone on the desk that you can just pick up buttons and a small lamp. So there's also some windows here and there is a bell there. So when she gets a call, um, uh, she can just uh, ring the bell and then she can call all the Ghostbusters and save the day. So what's really cool, the last thing up with this room, there's a pole. So what you do with the pole, this is an awesome place feature by the way, what you do with the pole is going to be this thing that you put on the pole, and when you put it, you let go, and then Ray can go down to the Ecto-1. Woo! He ends up on, all the way on the floor. Okay, one more time from the bottom. See? Fast and easy. So this was the Ecto-1. Pretty awesome build, by the way. And if you're a Ghostbuster fan, definitely get this set. And, or, other Playmobile sets. I love the Playmobile Ghostbuster line. If you guys are wondering, here is the back of the box. Showing all the other sets that you can get. The side. And the other side. And of course the front. So if you guys want to see more great reviews and stop motions, subscribe, like the video if you did, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peach Cove out.